What's up guys, welcome to new Unreal Engine 5 video. Yesterday, the full version of Unreal Engine 5.4 released, and now you can finally use it on production. So, in my recent video covering the preview, I highlighted the main features that were coming. So, let me summarize this for you in this video real quick, just in case you missed it. Also, I have already made tutorials for all of these features, so make sure to check them out. Let's begin with Nanai Tessellation. This allows Nanai meshes to be modified at runtime using a displacement map. Nanai Displacement tessellates the mesh at runtime into additional triangles to conform to the detail of the displacement map. So, now this will enable much more detail with better performance. As you can see, you can add 3D rocks, for example, with a material. I have already made a tutorial on this, so I will be leaving it in the description. Then we have Motion Matching. This will make your locomotions way more realistic and better looking. It blends different layers and animations together in real time to get this result. Again, I have already made a tutorial on it and how to use it, so check it out. Soon they will be releasing a free sample pack with over 500 animations, but there's no date yet. Next up is Modular Control Rig, which utilizes the entire framework of Control Rig for building robust animation rigs that are ready to be animated on any skeleton instantly. Basically, you can drag and drop rig models into your mesh. And that's it, you have a full body control rig created ready to be animated. Once again, I have already made a tutorial on this, so take a look. And if this wasn't enough for animation, automatic animation retargeting is here. Finally, after all that time manually creating bone chains, now we can just press a button and it will automatically create the IK rig and retarget it. So we can retarget make some animations, for example, in seconds. And guess what? I also have already made a tutorial on this, link in the description. There are many more features on this version, but of course, I just wanted to highlight once again the main ones. So that's it, if you found this video helpful, I would really appreciate it if you could like the video and subscribe to my channel. I have also Unreal Engine 5 videos and tutorials, so check them out. Check out my Patreon YouTube members for many benefits, join my Discord server, follow me on my socials, and now yes, with all that said, bye bye.